Hello, my name is Carrie Cottle and welcome to Read Aloud with Ms. Cottle. Today we are reading the interesting book, What Do Roots Do? Enjoy! What Do Roots Do? By Kathleen V. Kudlinski, illustrated by David Schubert. And published by Northward. What do roots do for their plants up above? They hold them up straight when the wind gives a shove. They hold them upright when the ground's on a slant. They hold them in place if you play on the plant. How else do they use this underground link? Plants are all thirsty. They use roots to drink. The roots branch out small, then tinier still. Then teeny root hairs drink the thirsty plants fill. Roots suck water in, then they send it up high through tubes far too tiny to see with your eye. Water flows up through rootlets, then tap roots and trunk, then branches, and twigs until each leaf's drunk all the water it needs. And then way up there, the rest blows away on a breeze in the air. Palm, pine, or maple, it always is true. Half of the tree will be hidden from you. Shadowed by treetops, green ferns, and moss grow. So do their roots in the darkness below. In sunny yards full of grass, weeds, and clover, you could see all the roots if you turn the dirt over. But you wouldn't do that. It wouldn't be wise. When you break off its roots, a plant often dies. Your garden is brightest and makes the most flowers when the roots have been watered by hose or by showers. Food grows in the garden, in vegetable row. Some ripens in sunshine, but some hides below. Carrot and radish, potato and beet, the underground root is the part that we eat. The roots of a cactus spread far to the sides or reach deep in soil for water that hides. And even in ponds, water lilies have found the best way to grow is with roots in the ground. So under each tree is a tree made of roots and under each rose and beneath bamboo shoots. Whenever you look at a plant short or tall, remember you don't see the whole thing at all. And here is a little bit about the author and the illustrator. That was What Do Roots Do? Did you learn something new about roots? I did. I love learning new things about the natural world because there's so much diversity and interconnectedness between all the different organisms on our planet. Do you know what else I learned about roots recently? That like in a grove of trees, the roots are connected and they actually help each other out kind of like families or communities help each other out through those strong roots. I love learning about nature and about the world around me, thinking about my place and all of it. Do you like doing that too? What part of nature do you like learning about? Look around and be curious and then find out some more information. And whatever you do, make sure to take care of each other.